Heidi Ho, and welcome to the Cover Price Top 10 for November 20th, 2023. But wait! Do you want to win free stuff? CoverPrice.com is partnering with CGC, CLZ, Figpins, Boom Studios, and Massive Publishing to offer some incredible giveaways for Black Friday and Cyber Monday, valuing over $3,500. Check it out in the link below. And now on to the top 10, starting at number 10. Black Panther number 6, Diwali 1 and 25, Marvel 2023. When the community saw the solicitation for this book, their attention was immediately on King Mtele. This 1 in 25 variant from Duale was King of the Pack, <laughs> featuring an exceptionally regal Mtele gracing the cover. We tracked a high sale of $167 for a raw copy with a current raw near mint FMV of $110. And number 9, the Century number 1, Marvel 2000. Robert Kirkman recently appeared on a live stream with David Finch and remarked, My good friend Stephen Yuen is playing the Sentry in a movie. There was some other context behind it, but you get the point. Vans immediately hit up the aftermarket in search of a copy. We tracked a high sale of $350 for a CGC 9.8 with a raw near mid FMV of $109. At number 8, it's Young Avengers 1 Marvel 2005. Potential spoilers for the Marvels! This book was going gangbusters during the incredible hype that WandaVision produced. It has done so again partly due to the end credits scene in the Marvels teasing the Young Avengers. We tracked the high sale of $350 for a CGC 9.8 with a current raw Nearman FMV of 70 bucks. And at number 7, X-Men 164 Marvel 1982. Spoilers! This comic book is tied directly to the end credits sequence of the Marvel's movie, and this book features the first appearance of Carol Danvers as Binary. This mention of Binary at the end credits scene has significant implications for the future of the Marvel Cinematic Universe, the MCU. As a result, this book has gained a lot of attention. Not sure why the Emperor showed up there, sorry. The highest sale was for a CGC 9.8 copy, selling for $250, and a raw, very fine copy is $27. At number 6, The Authority, DC 1999. This book is significant because it features the first team appearance of The Authority, and this has experienced a surge of demand thanks to James Gunn making his announcement, and it surged again now again thanks to James Gunn confirming Maria Gabriela de Faria's casting as the second engineer in the upcoming Superman Legacy Project. Many mentions by James Gunn make many things happen. This version of The Engineer first appeared in this comic, causing it to skyrocket in aftermarket demand. The highest sale was for a CGC 9.8, which sold for $300, and the current fair market value for a Ron Nearman copy, 46 bucks. At number 5, Marvel Superhero Secret Wars number 7, Direct Marvel 1984. This book features the full appearance of the second Spider-Woman, Julia Carpenter. We have a distinct shot of Sweeney rocking the famous costume in the trailer. It appears we will get a trio of Spider-Gals in the film, and since this rumor first circulated, Sweeney as Carpenter has been the one the fan base wanted. It appears we may just get that. We tracked a high sale of $250 for CGC 9.8 with a raw, very fine FMV of 16 bucks. Number 4, Amazing Fantasy number 1, Marvel 2004. This book popped off when the initial Madame Webb, Madam Webb, rumors began to swirl. The community had a peg from the get-go that Isabella Merced would portray Arana Corazon, who first appeared in this book in the film. With the trailer finally dropping, we saw the character in action, albeit briefly, and sporting her iconic goggles like she does in the comics. The community has their eyes on this character and this book. We tracked a high sale of $180 for a CGC 9.8 with a raw Nearman FMV of $34. At number 3, Amazing Spider-Man 210, Marvel 1980. The last time this book hit our list in the News Stand Edition was after Sony announced plans to move forward with the Madam Web solo film. Subsequently, her first appearance started seeing some heat in the aftermarket, and we tracked the high sale of $975 for a CGC 9.8 current raw, very fine FMV of $81, but it's number 3 on our list. Number 2, Amazing Spider-Man 30, Marvel 2001. Sony confirmed a 2022 rumor that Ezekiel Sims would appear in Madam Web, and he's being marketed as the movie's villain. His first appearance was in this comic book alongside Moreland. This issue is significant for several reasons. The fan base is becoming increasingly interested in the spider totem aspect of the story told within this book. The highest sale was for a CGC 9.8 copy, which sold for $200, and the current fair market value for a Ron Nearman copy is $47. And at number one, it's the Alien Legion, number one, Marvel 2001. Per The Hollywood Reporter, Tim Miller of Deadpool fame is set to adapt 
Alien Legion and grow it into a space opera franchise. Prices are rising thanks to the level of entry prevalence and the quickly dwindling market of cheap copies. We tracked a high sale of $158 for CGC 9.8 with a current raw fine FMV of $10. And that was your cover price top 10 for November 20th, 2023, Turkey Week! Cover price. You're home online by Comic Collecting.